Hello the Raps by viewers, my name's Peter and I've got a hands-on video for you. This time it's with Radboarding. Radboarding is from Other Ocean and it's also from Noodle Cake Studios. Uh, the companies behind Super Monkey Ball and Super Stickman Golf 1 and 2 respectively. Um, yes, they've made Radboarding. Radboarding is free to play. It is, well, <laughs> the press release that I've got in front of me describes it uh, quite, uh, quite energetically and uh, enthusiastically as SSX meets Tiny Wings um, and uh, I was a little bit sort of like, oh, that is a big claim. That is a big claim for radboarding right there, because those two things are pretty good. Um, and this is pretty good. Radboarding is pretty good, yo. Um, this is out on the 5th of March, I believe. Uh, so very soon, uh, when you're watching this video. And uh, it really is a combination of those two things. So you'll you'll be more than aware that this is, this is Tiny Wings. You know, like this, uh, basically you are whipping down a track and it's one button and you tap and hold when you're going downhill and that builds up speed and you let go when you're going up and that uh, gives you a whole bunch of lift so you do that and if you hit you know if you land and you hit an incline then you slow down dramatically and uh, there is a thing chasing after you in the case of this one in the case of this game uh, it is lava Oh, oh, getting very close, in fact. On top of racing very fast and jumping about, you can also do stunts and tricks. So you swipe on the screen, uh, down or left or right or up or whatever, uh, and you do a cool move. You might notice that there's a rainbow coming out of my uh, board. That's pretty cool as well, but that's because I'm in, I think it's called something like rad mode or something like that. Oh, Tiny the Bear nearly, oh, Tiny the Bear nearly got involved with that one as well. Hopefully we'll see Tiny the Bear in just a moment, but uh, Tiny the Bear is effectively like a boss you've got to beat, sort of, uh, by impressing it and doing tricks and so forth. Uh, so this is the main menu. I'm currently playing on the original track at the moment just because I, I, I quite like that track. Uh, there are different costumes to unlock. I've got my naked pantsy ones, uh, but I can transform into my original ones too. Uh, I've got different tombstones, so when you when you land, and you know when you're dead, basically, you you can have a different tombstone. Uh, like I said, there's different different levels. Uh, you swipe through these menus. There's also upgrades that you can get, so I can delay the lava start. I can get a boosted rad mode magnet range, which basically pulls in. The, the sort of coins I suppose when you're in that rad mode you can also see which tricks you've got uh, and then there are milk caps to collect you get these by squishing frogs um, uh, don't it, it it does sort of all make sense you notice that it says no coin doublers like I say this is a free to play game uh, and um, you know it's got all of that all of that stuff in there there's also advertising quite a fair amount of interstitial advertising actually I think usually you get about one or two goes before the game goes right let's show you an ad which is fine you know, like you know people people got to eat um, but uh, it's a little bit it's a little bit annoying if you don't plan on paying any money but then if you don't plan on paying any money then pff, you know not exactly supporting the developer are they um, so uh, basically uh, you know it feels the reason it actually kind of justifies that SSX Tiny Wings thing is that the Tiny Wings gameplay is kind of here, like I think it's there for everybody to see. Uh, but the SSX thing, look at how over the top and ridiculous this is. How bright and colourful and flamboyant the whole thing is. It really does shine of that PlayStation 2 era SSX. Get up, get up. There we go. Um, get up, no! Oh, I got covered in lava again. Oh, and here we are. Here's an advert for SimCity Build It. A totally alright um, building game, which we've actually got video of on App Spy, so you can go and see that if you want to. It's alright. It's pretty good. Um, that's landed. Fantastic. And we've got a high score. We can share it with our friends. Server isn't available right now, uh, just simply because I haven't got the internet connected. But you'll be able to hang out with your friends and see you know, how well you're doing compared to your mates. Um, but yeah, this is over the top and ridiculous and lovely, and I love the fact that the camera keeps like zooming in and zooming out. It's really dynamic, really makes you makes makes it feel like super energetic, and I quite like that. Um, and it's got a, a fun sense of humour as well. Uh, you, like I say, you you kind of collect and squish frogs, uh, and that gives you 
power-ups. It's all set in like this post-apocalyptic world in which you kind of, I, I kind of get the feeling that you've st sort of started the apocalypse so that you could have like the ultimate snowboarding ride, which is, I mean, it's, an, it's a noble effort, I suppose, in some regards, but um, yeah, it is, but this is just really neat. I, I think it's, I think it's really fun, super fun, um, and extremely polished. Um, if you've noticed any stutters or anything like that throughout this video, I don't know whether or not they're going to show off in the video. Um, that's simply because this is running through an Elgato uh, cap game capture device, and when you do that, it does put a little bit of stress on the actual device that you're running it on. So um, I wouldn't worry about these uh, small little hiccups and starts because um, they're not present when I haven't got it plugged into the hardware that I use to capture video. Um, but yeah, it's uh, it's neat. It's really good, and it kind of follows on the long tradition of very good uh, games from the two developers. Um, yeah, it's it, it, it's neat. Now, can, are we going to get to the bear? That's the big question that's on everyone's mind. I know, I know that it is. Oh, look at these fly flips. They are so cool. Fresh. No, it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Oh well, never mind. Um, this is rad boarding. It's out on the fifth of March. It's free to play. It's coming to iOS. It's pretty good. It's pretty darn good, actually. It's pretty darn good. Let me know what you think of it in the comments. This is Peter with AppSpy.com. We review. You decide.